Your child is seizing and they're convulsing and they're jumping off the bed. She would hit all day. This would go on 12 hours. Her lips turned blue and her eyes rolled back. She had her first seizure when she was 10 months. Never in a million years did I ever think that this would be my life. Oh my gosh. Hey, hey. I mean, how do you just sit back and just accept my child's gonna die? No, you do something about it. The destination is on your left. Arrived. I thought this place would be like garden. It's nerve wracking knowing that I have to go to Colorado to get the cannabis. I am breaking the law. Wow. <laughs> I've definitely never seen anything like this before. What you're doing is illegal. Um, a lot of people take the risk anyways. They don't want to be the cause of you getting your kid taken away no. by CPS. And right. they will take your kid. Don't tell your family members. Don't tell your nurse. Don't tell your doctor. Don't tell your family, nobody, your friends. Protective custody warrant for the daughter, okay? Grab our key, lock the door behind us. All right, me and my wife are coming out, all right? Hey, hello. Hi. How are you guys? Are you going to close the door? No, no, no. no. Hey, what is going on? Relax, relax. Hey, hey, hey. Put your hands behind Why are you doing this? Just the one daughter who's named in the warrant is going to be taken into protective custody. I want to call the cops because people are about to take our daughter. She's going to freak out. She's in better hands with her parents who love her. But the cops are taking our daughter. You might have to go somewhere for a little bit, OK? Look at me, OK? But um, mommy and daddy can't go, OK? I love you, OK? It's all right, baby. It's OK. We're not smugglers, we're just moms getting medicine for kids who are really struggling. Until you've walked in someone's shoes, there's no room to judge. We've lived in fear of our government since we started. A single cookie is a felony. Ten to life in prison. I cannot just allow my child to just sit back and suffer. I'm trying to save my son. We could possibly lose our kids to DHS. She was to pretend that, you know, that, that's not a possibility. I definitely know it's a possibility, but I'm willing to take that risk to help him. If he's going down, I'm going down with him. The fact that the federal government is making us choose between breaking the law to help our child or watching them suffer is absurd. Yeah, she's happy. You're fixing your hair. Uh-huh. Say hi. Look, you're waving. <laughs> <laughs>